Okay. So, discuss ko naman yun yung Faraday's uh, experiment of electric flux or kung tawagin niya uh, displacement flux. Okay. Paano niya ginawa yun? Kumuha siya ng isang metal sphere uh, ball. Sphere ball. Metal ball. Ginawa niya, chinarge niya to positive. So, ito, meron akong initial charge na positive Q. Anong ginawa niya dyan sa metal sphere na yan, nasa metal uh, ball na yan? Nilagay niya ito sa isang uh, hollow metal uh, sphere ulit. Ngayon, yung pagitan nito is uh, dielectric. Dielectric. Or the air. Ano ginawa niya dyan? Pagkalagay niya dun sa loob, ginaround niya. Okay. Tapos, kumuha siya ng isang instrument uh, which is the galvanometer. Uh, Kinunect niya yun dito with respect sa ground. Tapos, napansin niya, nagulat siya, negative Q. Yung reading. Same magnitude but different in sign. Sabi niya, ba't ganun? Dielectric or air, yung pagitan ng metal uh, ball dun sa inner part, tsaka dun sa hollow, na theorize niya, there's some kind of uh, displacement flux. No? Or, flux is analogous to the word flow. Ah, kung makikita nyo sa dictionary, ano? para siyang uh, water flux, water flow, uh, sand flux, sand flow. No? Sabi niya, may nag-travel from this, papunta dun sa outer spear para maging ganun yung reading okay. tinawag niya yung displacement na yun as the displacement flux displacement flux or tinawag niya rin yung electric flux so electric uh, electric line electric lines from the initial uh, met metal ball sphere papunta dun sa hollow okay. and from that point nag siya na yung electric flux which is denoted by the Greek uh, letter psi is just equal to the initial charge dun sa loob So, uh, this is basically the uh, Faraday's experiment of uh, the discovery of the electric flux or kung tawagin niya the displacement flux. So, uh, please watch the next video which is the Gauss Law. So, sa Gauss Law, uh, mas maiintindihan natin no? ano ba tong mga electric flux na to, no? Ano ba yung, uh, ano ba yung uh, relationship nito dun sa electric field lines na napoproduce nitong mga positively charged. So, please watch that video and uh, hope you understand this concept and thank you for listening.